very personal experience that I went through in my life and I'm sure we can all learn from each other's experiences. So many times in relationships, you know, both personal and professional, we, uh, we tend to become like saviors, like, you know, at least I tend to become like a savior where I want to jump in and actually save the person. By, oh, this is going wrong. This is something which will hurt you. This is not good for your well-being. And for a very long time, I remained in this space. Now, what happens is when you are in this space, it was very, very stressful because I'm not able to control what the other person is doing. And the other person is also terribly unhappy and the relationship is completely going downhill and the results are not happening. Right? So as I was, uh, you know, I realized that this is not working, I moved to the second phase where I stopped saying what I feel, but I was holding this anger very strongly within myself saying I am right and this person is wrong you know this is good and this is bad I am being in I was very inflexible and again really uh, nothing of value came out the third stage which came out was when you know this relationship was really important for me and I started making few changes and I started accepting the person just the way they are you know not putting in any rules and biases and enjoying their company, having small get-togethers, laughs and the bonding really improved and this is a place for me which I think is true love because when you accept somebody 100%, all of a sudden, all that you desired for that person starts happening and I think as leaders, this is imperative for us to accept people irrespective of who they are and where they come from.